Okay, so Graham is going to show us how to make a fortune teller. Okay. So first, you have to have scissors. Scissors. And then you have to go like this. And then you have to crease it down. And then once you have that done, you have to cut this whole thing off. Why you need to cut it off? To make it square. Okay. Then, when you are done with that, you need to fold it that way. So it makes an X. And then you need to fold it. Jamie, do you want to do the next step? Sure. You just need to fold it up again. Well, how am I supposed to do that if I'm recording? Do you want me to hold it? For you? Yeah. Okay, you do it. <coughs> I'm okay. <clears throat> then, oh, it looks like a snowflake. So then you see the middle, and then you gotta fold all the corners to the middle. No, what do you know? Then you gotta flip it over and do the same thing that you just did. Fold all the corners to the middle. Now, what do you do? Okay, now you flip it over one more time and you'll see the cross. And then, yep, you yeah, put your finger right where the cross is on the other side. And then make sure all the, the corners are tucked in. And fold it. Ah! You missed the dog! Then you gotta fold it like that. Then you turn it. Then you then you fold it like that. Then you turn it one more time. And this is the hard part. So you crease it one more time. And then you grab right here and you push in. And it makes the cross and you gotta pull the corners out. So then it turns. Ah! This, this looks crappy. It looks like poo poo. Poo poo! What? That's how you make a fortune teller. <laughs> bye bye. bye. Oh, hold on, the camera was bad. Bye bye.